One thing that I've learned to do, and this is a method that Dave and Adian actually shared with me, is to tuck the wrist in towards the, the rib of the violin so as to isolate the bigger parts of the arm. And then you just essentially learn how to deal with this motion, train for this motion, just from the fingers. So vibrato is initiated by the fingers. And regardless of what kind of speed or amplitude of the vibrato you're opting for, I think the impulse always comes from the fingers because those are the parts that are closest to the string and that easily transmits that energy that you need.